Good morning, everyone. Welcome. This is Art in Day to Day. The beating heart of the museum is the collection, and the API is a way for us to then bring that into other forums. The intuition at SF MoMA is when we're um, approaching a new problem or trying to tackle a new set of problems is to lean on the creative community that animates the Bay Area. We apply that thinking to the exhibitions we put on, to the books that we write, to the shows that we tour. But we also apply it to things like the technologies we use and the ways we use them. And so it kind of feels normal and natural for us at the moment to let the artists and the creative thinkers in the Bay Area use this API and, and have access to this metadata before anyone else, because it's only through their questions that we'll better understand how it can be used in the future. Today is really about banging on this new API. How can we make this API really great for your ideas, for the future of ideas, for interoperability between like other museum APIs? Are there themes that you're starting to gravitate towards? Mapping artwork in the collection to external sources. It'll be interesting to mine that information from Google. I'd love to do something with the content of the images. When was the artwork created versus when was it introduced into the collection? What I think is interesting that we're doing in the group I'm working with today is we're talking about context. Usually you see art and it's like hanging on the white wall in the gallery. And it's sort of deliberately divorced from context because you're trying to remove these distractions and being able to focus on the piece. But we, I guess, want to introduce some of those distractions in a way to help you situate how you understand the art. The, the GDP for the Bay Area for the last 50 years. And and we think about data visualization as a medium. And once you start to do that, you know, if you stop thinking about it as a set of technologies and thinking about it more like a medium, then you can start to have the same kind of conversations about it that you do about photography or painting or writing or movie making. And you can start to think about genres inside that medium. You know, framing everything into a square or something. Yeah. And then we just kind of like... That will give you like a nice compact way of measuring stuff. That's really crazy. <laughs> so what this opportunity offers us in terms of building an API and then allowing this community to play against it and see what comes up is for us to discover ways of telling stories that we've never had the capability to tell before. There's certain things in the data, the distribution of our artists across geography, the value of artworks changing over time, the materials that are used from one decade to another, that really can only be opened up by this kind of exploratory work.